The Reader's Guide to Periodical Literature is an underutilized source at Bloomsburg University because it isn't digitized. Yet it provides an excellent wealth of materials to explore historical topics. So don't just limit yourself to JSTOR or Project Muse. Make sure you take advantage of the Reader's Guide to Periodical Literature. In this video I'm going to explain the difference between magazines and journals. Also introduce you to the Reader's Guide to Periodical Literature. The Reader's Guide to Periodical Literature should be consulted when you're trying to find magazine articles or advertisements from historical periods dating back to 1900 to the present. Now if you're a state employee you actually have access through your Commonwealth Library card to the electronic database for the Reader's Guide to Periodical Literature. However, students here at Bloomsburg University will most likely need to use this physical copies that are located at least currently on the first floor of the library. In other tutorials I've explained what journal articles are. Magazine articles are periodically published and they offer a collection of essays, articles, images. They could be published weekly, monthly, quarterly. They're great sources to explore cultural history, the history of how media uh, informs and tries to persuade. Sometimes it can be an indirect barometer of public opinion. The content of the magazines might reveal trends and ideas, belief systems, values, clothing styles, as well as information about commercial products. A magazine differs from journals in a num number of ways. Their target audience is a far broader general public. The appearance of magazines is often attractive, includes glossy paper, many illustrations, and, and many advertisements. The authors of the articles within magazines are usually journalists and not necessarily subject experts, though sometimes a journalist has definitely built up a subject interest. And the sources within the magazines are not routinely cited. So what magazines are indexed in the Reader's Guide? The magazines that are indexed are found in the front matter of every volume of the Reader's Guide to Periodical Literature. And this is just the first page under the A's. And you can see that there's quite a diversity of sources, some of which are actually intended for more scholarly audiences than others. The Annals of the American Academy of Political and Social Science and the Atlantic Monthly tend towards a more intellectual audience, whereas American Home, just based on its title, appears to be for quote the housewife. First of all I would make a list of potential search terms. Now you can search by author and by subject heading but with respect to subject headings oftentimes those subjects reflect the vernacular of the time. So you're not going to find inherently Library of Congress subject headings and as a result, you may have to play around a little bit, experiment with the subject terms that you're going to search by. In the next video, I'll demonstrate how to find magazine articles by offering up a specific example.